Tonight, people in Hidalgo County are worried about the Zika virus. Health officials announced a possible localized case on Friday. Channel 5's Lauren Kendrick joins us now with more. Lauren. Steve, folks we talked to today at a McAllen Park say they are worried about the first possible case of Zika here in Hidalgo County. McAllen ISD teacher Janet Johnston says she's not surprised to hear about the possible case. All along I've been somewhat aware and I kind of thought it was inevitable, like it's slowly been creeping closer. Johnston says she found out about it when she got an email Friday afternoon. I had been paying attention and I had heard it was in Brownsville and there's so many people who travel back and forth from here to Brownsville that you know, the mosquitoes can travel too. Someone who also found out that way is Lilan Hu. Her daughter attends McAllen ISD. She says she immediately took precautions. Made me very conscientious. I went out and poured over some uh, pool. I had a pot plant with lots of water. I tipped it over and it's like, well, where's my insect repellent? Javier Alonso came to the park with his family and grandchildren. He says he doesn't worry about a mosquito with Zika biting him. However, he does worry about a certain group of people. Especially women that are trying to have kids, you know, because other than that, a mosquito is just a mosquito. Alonzo and the others we spoke with tell us they want everyone to be aware of the threat of Zika and help prevent it from spreading to their community. Hidalgo County health officials have not released any details about the potential case. Officials did say they will release more information on Tuesday. Reporting in the studio, Lauren Kendrick, Channel 5 News, This Weekend.